Is it time to buy or sell quantum computing stock? In this video, we're diving deep into quantum computing. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, the 27th of November, 2024. And now, we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any one among 45,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered financial advice. Since the 14th of October, 2024, our system has identified quantum computing as a buy candidate, assigning it a score of 2.07. Now let us examine the stock's performance during this time frame. Those who followed our analysis would have experienced an impressive gain of 831.03% since we first designated quantum computing as a buy candidate 33 days ago. This remarkable increase translates to an average daily return of 25.18% since it received the buy candidate designation. The stock is currently positioned in the upper segment of a broad and robust upward trend over the short term. This situation often creates an attractive selling opportunity for short-term traders, as a reaction back towards the lower segment of the trend can be anticipated. A breakout above the upper trend line at $7.82 would indicate a stronger rate of increase. Analyzing the current three-month trend, it suggests a potential change of approximately 94.43% over the next three months, with possible returns ranging from a decrease of 43.26% to an increase of 125.21%. Regarding the 12-month trend, it indicates a change of around 12.55% over the coming year, with potential returns varying from a decline of 87.06% to an increase of 28.51%. This could result in a price range between $0.87 cents and $8 and 67 cents after one year. Our latest daily update for quantum computing includes the headline, High Volatility in Quantum Computing Incorporated Stock Price on Wednesday, which ended trading at $6.75. The Quantum Computing Incorporated Stock Price gained 1.5% on the last trading day, Wednesday, the 27th of November, 2024, rising from $6.65 to $6.75. During the last trading day, the stock fluctuated 30.73%, with a low of $5.89 and a high of $7.70. The price has risen in seven of the last 10 days and is up by 153.76% over the past two weeks. Volume has increased alongside the price on the last day, which is a positive technical sign, with 2 million more shares traded than the day before. In total, 47 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $319.10 million. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest stock price was $9.20, and the lowest price was $0.35.5. Cents. Currently, the price is 26.63%, or $2.45, below the 52-week high and 73.08% or $18.32 below the all-time high on December 21, 2020, when the price reached $25.07. Quantum Computing Incorporated, referred to as QUBT, is drawing considerable attention in the market following several significant developments. The company is projected to launch its semiconductor plant in Arizona by the first quarter of 2025. This could enhance its production capacity and strengthen its position in the rapidly evolving quantum computing sector. 
Recent news emphasizes QUBT's partnership with Amazon Web Services, a collaboration that has resulted in a notable increase in stock prices. Following this announcement, QUBT shares rose by over 20%, reflecting a surge in investor confidence. The unique features of this partnership may allow quantum computing access to Amazon's extensive cloud platform, considerably broadening its market reach and potential customer base. Furthermore, QUBT has recently secured a second purchase order for its photonic chip from the University of Texas, signaling early demand for its technology. This is particularly important as the thin film lithium niobate chips are expected to double data transmission speeds while reducing energy consumption, aligning with current trends in artificial intelligence and quantum computing. However, the company is not without challenges. Concerns have been raised regarding potential shareholder dilution following a direct offering of common stock valued at $40 million, which may influence stock performance if not handled prudently. Additionally, competition from established players in the quantum computing field may pose ongoing risks. In the short term, the positive momentum from partnerships and production milestones could propel stock prices higher. Conversely, long-term growth will rely on sustained demand for its technology and successful scaling of operations. Investors will need to keep a close watch on how these developments unfold as QUBT navigates this dynamic landscape. Analyst Ratings On Monday, the 15th of April, 2024, it was reported that Ascendiant assigned a buy grade to QUBT, accompanied by a hold action. Analysts have assigned a general sell rating to quantum computing stock. They consider the price-to-earnings ratio to be a buy and the price-to-book ratio as a buy as well. However, regarding return on investment, the analysts rate the stock as a strong sell. The following signals have been identified for quantum computing. The stock of Quantum Computing Incorporated shows buy signals from both short and long-term moving averages, indicating a positive outlook. Additionally, a general buy signal arises from the relationship between the two averages, with the short-term average positioned above the long-term average. In the event of a downward correction, Support can be expected at $5.45 and $2.18. A drop below either of these levels would trigger sell signals. Moreover, a buy signal has emerged from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, or MACD. Notably, volume is increasing alongside the price, which is regarded as a favorable technical indicator. However, some negative signals have also been generated, which may impact short-term developments. A sell signal was issued following a pivot top point on Monday, November 25, 2024, resulting in a decline of 12.34% thus far. Further declines are anticipated until a new bottom pivot is established. Here are some additional signals that may pique your interest. Moving average convergence divergence, buy signal, pivots, sell signal three days ago, Bollinger Bands, buy signal 30 days ago, short-term moving average, buy signal 7 days ago, long-term moving average, sell signal 36 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages indicates a buy signal 54 days ago. Analyzing the 12-month chart reveals short moving average, sell signal 36 days ago, long-term moving average, buy signal 42 days ago. The relationship between the short and long moving averages suggests a buy signal 44 days ago. For more signals, remember to visit our page at stockinvest.us. Support, risk, and stop loss for quantum computing. Quantum Computing Incorporated identifies support from accumulated volume at $6.65. This level may present a buying opportunity as an upward reaction is anticipated when the support is tested. The stock exhibits significant daily movement, indicating high volatility, and with a broad prediction interval from the Bollinger Band, it is classified as very high risk. In the previous day, the stock fluctuated $1.81 between its highest and lowest points, reflecting a change of 30.73%. Over the past week, the average daily volatility of the stock has been 32.88%.
Before we dive into the potential trading levels for quantum computing, let's briefly discuss some important fundamental data. First, we have the price to earnings ratio, commonly referred to as the PE ratio. This vital ratio assesses a company's current share price in relation to its earnings per share. A negative PE ratio indicates that the company is experiencing negative earnings or is operating at a loss. Even well-established companies can face downturns, often due to factors beyond their control. However, persistent negative PE ratios may suggest inadequate profitability and could signal the risk of bankruptcy. Additionally, the next earnings report for the fourth quarter of 2024 is anticipated on March 31, 2025. Now, let's discuss some potential day trading levels for quantum computing. In the event of an upward trend, the first resistance level for quantum computing is at $7.70. If you do not own any shares, consider waiting for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a point to contemplate for swing trading. On the downside, quantum computing faces its first support level at $6.65. If this support level holds, it may be a favorable entry point, anticipating a rebound. The combined average rating for quantum computing from various analyst sources is to sell. Now let's review some recent insider trades. On the fourth day of October in the year 2024, Weimar Carl Scott executed an insider purchase of 100,000 shares of options to acquire common stock. On the same day, Termel Michael C. also conducted an insider purchase of 100,000 shares of options for common stock. Additionally, on that day, Faginson Robert B. made an insider purchase of 100,000 shares of options to purchase common stock. On the 4th of October, Bohmler Christopher carried out an insider purchase of 125,000 shares of options to acquire common stock. Just a day earlier, on the 3rd of October, Bohmler Christopher conducted an insider purchase of 259,700 shares of common stock. Analyzing the 74 most recent insider trades, we find the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 76.093. In total, insiders have purchased 56,150,711 shares while selling 1,291,445 shares in these last 74 trades. Our suggested stop loss is set at $6.38, reflecting a decrease of 5.54%. This stock experiences significant daily fluctuations, which contributes to a heightened level of risk. Additionally, there is a sell signal indicated by a pivot top that was identified two days ago. Is quantum computing stock a good buy? Several short-term indicators, along with an overall positive trend, suggest that this may be a good opportunity to consider purchasing shares. There is a reasonable likelihood that Quantum Computing Incorporated stock will perform well in the near future. After examining the volatility and movements from the last trading day, our analysis indicates that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Friday, the 29th of November, we anticipate that quantum computing will open at $0.03 cents and begin trading at $6.78. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money and that you should consult with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. Your investment decisions should not be based solely on StockInvest.us. By utilizing this information, you acknowledge and accept responsibility for your own investment choices. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Please share your thoughts in the comments below. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. We wish you successful trading and hope you have a beautiful day. With warm regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.